Welcome to the CCE webpage tutorial. In this video, you will learn about the login process and the setup of the administrative section. Now, to begin, in order to log on to the website, you must go to cceTompkins.org, scroll down to the bottom of the page, and click on the small copyright sign in the lower left-hand corner. This will bring you to a screen asking for your email address and password. Enter your information. If you have not set up an account to edit web pages, please see the communications coordinator, Sandy Rep, to do so. If you forget your password, please click on the Request New Password button, and a new one will be sent to you. After you successfully log in, you will be taken to the administrative section. You have the option of organizing this section in two ways, by task and by module. This is the by task option that you see in front of you right now. It is the default option in the view you will see when you first log in. This view shows you information about your specific account, a link to web forms that have been created and their contents, a box to create new content, and a box to edit the menu navigation. If you choose to organize by module, you will be brought to a page that will show you the two modules you can edit, web forms and menus. These links bring you to the exact same pages, which are linked to from the by task option. Once you are logged into the website, you can return to the administrative section by simply scrolling down to the bottom of any CCE Tompkins webpage and clicking on the small copyright sign. If you are no longer logged in, the site will prompt you for your username and password. For more information about creating and editing web pages, please refer to the other web page tutorials. 